Hey everyone, today we have an exciting DIY tutorial for all of you. I'll show you how to design a stunning daily planner that you can um, sell on Etsy or Amazon KDP. Um, basically anywhere um, you can sell it on. It's a digital product and um, as you all know, digital products are a great way to earn a passive income. Um, so in order to get started, you need to have a Canva account because we're going to be making this on Canva. And after that, uh, we're going to make it and then we're going to sell it. Are you ready? So now that we're on Canva, um, the first thing you need to do is have an account. So if you don't have one, just sign up for free. And all the elements that we're going to use are going to be free. So don't worry about um, having a pro version. Just sign up for free and let's get started. So before we begin designing, um, we have to decide on the size of our daily planner. Um, the most popular sizes are A4, letter, or A5, but today we're going to go for the A4 size. And uh, that's just my preference. You can go ahead with anything you want, but I'm going to go for A4. And um, once this opens, we are going to begin our designing. Uh, now we have to plan our sections. Um, common sections are, of course, a cover page, daily schedule, to do list, goal setting, notes, but um, I'm just going to show you a very generic. Um, um, planner. It's going to be a one-page planner, which you can, uh, you know, easily make and then sell. So let's get started. Um, okay, so I'm going to be using a lot of text here. Um, you know, I'm not going to be using a lot of elements, um, just a lot of text. And for that, I'm going to go for um, text and add a heading. I'm going to write daily planner. And um, this is a very basic design, you know, easy. You don't need to have any design sense. Um, of course, you can use your um, own aesthetic sense, but um, I'm just going to be very, very um, simple about it. Um, I'm going to go for this font, and I want the color to be this. This looks nice. I'm going to add another text box. I'm going to write and I'm going to do this um, in cursive. I am also going to make this a little smaller. And we're going to change the color of this to something um, like this. Once we're done with that, um, I'm going to make some sections here. We're going to go into elements and we're going to go for lines. Mm 
and we're, we're going to fix everything so that um you know so that it prints easily but now we're gonna now that i've divided all of this i'm going to be adding the text You guys must be thinking why I'm so quiet. Well, the thing is, I like to focus when I'm working, so, um, which is why I'm a little quiet. Um, I'm not so good at multitasking. And when I'm doing something, I just want to be doing it and not chat. I feel if I speak while I'm doing this, um, I'm going to mess it up. So I just want to be very precise and, um, not actually precise, but I want to not mess up um, and be focused. So, yeah, if you're following me, then um, so we all have yearly goals, right? So yeah, we can you know, take it as a short-term goal, a long-term goal, a medium goal. So a year goal would be a long-term goal. Um, month goal would be your medium goal, medium-term goal. And um, your weekly goal could be your short-term goal. You know, you can add in whatever you want. Whatever your goals are, go get them. Right now, our goal is to make this planner and make some money off of it so yeah and i'm just gonna show you an easy way to do this 
So now that we have all of this in place, we do need a few other things. And yeah, so we're going to need a dotted line and that's going to be here. But we're going to change the thickness to two. Two. Um, three is fine, however. I'm just gonna put in um, AM and PM. I'm gonna make this small. Yeah, and we're going to. to go for and we're gonna change the thickness to three three seems like a nice thickness and we are just going to be adding just you know for a circle. I'm also going to be changing the lines, letter spacing. I need more letter spacing. This looks fine. Um, and again, I'm going to change the color to pink. And you can circle whichever you want. And, um, you know, I feel. I want to change the font to something thinner. Hmm. I like gray seal indifference. This just looks nice. It just changes the whole vibe. I didn't like the board formed. This just means, you know, if you don't like it, go back, change it. There's no shame in it. You know, you're constantly learning and um and yeah, this just looks so much better like this. There we have it. Um, for the mood, I am thinking of emojis. Emojis. Hmm. We could go for this one. Good. Go for hmm. 
um, sad emoji. We need a couple more lines to add here, and we're going to change the thickness to two. And we're just going to make this a little bit of spacing. I'm going to delete a couple from here in order to make some space. this up. This looks better. Now we just need some check boxes. Check box. Mm, so these we could go for a square and uh, we can we can make this a little smaller. this along. You can always tidy it up. Doesn't look tidy now, does does it?
so there you have it a very simple planner um i'm going to be linking the template in the description for you to download and play around with colors and you know if you can make this better go ahead and uh, share with me i hope you like the tutorial thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe